Hello and welcome to another pumpkin episode of Beer Bros. Simple. <laughs> <laughs> The first beer of the week to start off and kick off our pumpkin uh, season, or to actually wind up our pumpkin season, is going to be uh, our Kentucky Pumpkin Barrel Ale. I think you'll find this one significantly different from the previous pumpkin okay. beers that we've had this month. So again, from our friends over in Kentucky, not sure if that's brewed there, but uh, Kentucky is responsible for a lot of bourbon in the United States. It's become uh, actually more of a, uh, a hobby for people to brew their own bourbons. Mm -hmm. What? I was getting to you. <laughs> okay. So, why don't you give us a description of what it might look like, Keith? Looks like a mini tornado. A uh, mini tornado. It's dying off now, but it's clear, very Tornado effervescent, <laughs> and tan head. And again, the the pumpkin theme is is obviously what we're going for, but that doesn't mean that we can't find some more additives that go into this particular beer. Mm -hmm. so. Give it a smell. It doesn't smell as strong as some of the other pumpkin beers we've had, but I get a hint, hint of the bourbon. And I was, I was kind of on the opposite side. I think I smell a little bit more pumpkin and more nutmeg, more spices than I do the, the bourbon, but there is a little bit of there. I was expecting it to be more. Uh, typically in the, the bourbon barrel uh, variety of beers that we have or we've tried before, the bourbon was extremely, extremely strong once you open the, mm -hmm. the container and once you open the bottle. Let's go ahead and uh, maybe give it a try, clinky drinky, see what we, we think, what it tastes like. Get a lot of the bourbon and the hint of the spices. Yeah, it's it's the bourbon kind of warms your warms your mouth, mm -hmm. and uh, you can taste the the alcohol content. So let me see if I can find the ABV on this. Are there any other things that you notice within the, the taste of the beer? Pumpkin spices. Still, for me, it's not coming moderate. out as strong as some of the other beers we've had. Okay, so a moderate pumpkin spice. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you, at the end, I got a little bit of a roasted flavor. Mm -hmm. So something maybe like a roasted pumpkin, um, something along those lines where there's malts that are involved and that are infused in the, the tail end of it. 10% ABV, so it's a pretty pretty strong beer. It's um, it's amazing how it's still effervescing. I think yeah. you, you pointed that out. <laughs> it looked like a tornado, but uh, man, it's, it's really, really um, bubbling up to the top there. Like, comment, subscribe down below. Let us know if you have any more pumpkin flavored beers that you'd like us to try. We're almost running out of time for this this year, but that doesn't mean that it won't carry over mm -hmm. into November. Pumpkin is actually all the way until Christmas, I believe, isn't it? Like, well, at least Thanksgiving. Yeah, yeah. at least Thanksgiving. So um, we have time to do a few more. Uh, we like to spread the variety out. So uh, keep us up, keep us posted on uh, new releases, and we'll do our best to get our hands on them. So. I guess until Wednesday, beer bros out. Yep. Kentucky pumpkin bear. Are you excited? Thank you.